please welcome Robbie Williams. Hi, guys. Welcome. We are very excited to have you here in Australia. Your tour kicks off this week. It's been like a bad karaoke night around our office today. We've all been singing your greatest hits. Can you confirm this will be a greatest hits tour? Um, yes, what I think have been the greatest hits in Australia, yes, you will see them. There's, there's a song called Candy, which was a massive song everywhere else apart from Australia that I sang last year when I was on tour, thinking, this will slay them. I've got this in the back pocket, <laughs> watch me get this one out, and I've got this one out, and the whole audience just went... <laughs> And it wasn't until I got back to my hotel, I was like, what happened with Candy? And then I was like, Google. Oh, number 58 in the Australian chart. So I won't be doing that again. Robbie, which song gets people most excited? Because we've been arguing about our favourite today, but which one does the crowd go off for? Let me entertain you, because, you know, there's points where I go bounce and everybody goes bounce and, you know, it's energetic and, uh, and Angels, of course, is, you know, an incredibly emotional point of the evening every time I sing it. So I suppose it's, uh, let me entertain you and Angels, but there are others. Oh, well, there are plenty of others, Robbie, of course. And uh, I've heard, though, that you don't believe you have a great singing voice. Now, surely this is untrue. What's with the lack of confidence, Robbie? I've always said that I, I've never been the best singer or the best dancer, um, but people still come. They put my picture on the poster and still people come. <laughs> I don't know why, but they do. And, uh, and I'm here again, and I'm very, very excited. Australian audiences are uh, amazing, and uh, they're even better at the weekends when they're drunk. <laughs> yeah, but do you just say that wherever you go? If not, can you nominate a country where the audiences are crap? <laughs> yeah, well, listen, I'm very fortunate because I, I seem to have amazing audiences. There's only been a couple of gigs this year that were, mm, and uh, one was because I, I chose the wrong venue, and the other one was in a country that will remain nameless, um, <laughs> and they're, they're always not that great. Oh, they're in Europe. Oh, well, okay, well, what's, what's the national dish of that country? <laughs> Um, I don't know, something Swedishy. 